Do you want to draw a septic tank and you don't know where to start from? Or do you need a guide on how a septic tank looks like a plan of the septic tank? Now, this video, on this video, we shall look at a septic tank. We have one here and we are going to go through it together. So that is our septic tank. That is section XX. And down here, we have the plan. So this is the plan of the septic tank of how it looks. If you can see, we have our pipe here going going in. So this is our inlet. This is cover. These are the walls, the inside walls, the buffer walls. And then we have uh, an, another pipe here to the manual and then to the, to the outlet, to the exit. So this is our plan of the septic tank. So we want to, we are, we've been given here section YY so that we can be able to get the fine details of the of the septic tank now let's go to the section that we've been given so that we can see what it consists we are going to start from the bottom the bottom here we have what is down here this one here is 75 millimeters blinding and then after that we have this concrete here which is 200 millimeters thick one is to one and a half is to three bed this concrete here that concrete there and then you can see we've been given the the depth the depth of that one is 200 that one there and then we come to the walls we have a projection here of 225 this is a projection of 225 millimeters the same way to this one so yeah it's projecting it's projecting by 225 so from there we have this wall here we have these walls that are constructed they are 225 millimeters thick concrete one is two two is to four wall so this is 225 and this is 225 and then we go up we go up to the slab let's first go to the slab the slab is 200 millimeters thick concrete one is to one and a half is to three bed with 12 millimeters bar at 200 millimeters center to center both ways so this is our slab here and then we are going we, we have a cover so meaning we have an opening here and we have an opening here and we have an opening here so the opening is 600 by 450 millimeters medium duty cover and then we have what next we have we have plaster so we plaster our walls both on the outside and on the inside when we come into the inside so this waste or sewer comes in like that it goes in down down if it gets full it will just pass down go up and then it's going to exit here go to this manual and then to the to the outside exit so this is a, a manual if you look at the plan we've been given its dimension it's 900 900 by what 900 by 900 by this is 150 the external is 150 plus 1200 plus 150 this is our manual for the length it is for the width and then we have this exit exit pipe or the outlet pipe and then what are we left with we've said we have this 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 is a pipe that is exiting that way these are our buffer walls so guys that is how the septic tanks looks like in case you want to draw or in case you want to design a septic tank those are the details that you need and then you can also notice that we have some height here from the from the pipe from the entry from this inlet pipe you can see we have some height some depth here from this point up to this point is 350 and then from this point upwards the wall protrudes upwards by by 500 and then you can see from the ground level up to this point where we have the pipe is 1200 and then down is 3500 3, so guys that is how our septic tank looks like for the plan and for the section that you've been given so that we can be able to use it to understand the fine fine details so guys thank you for your time thank you for your support kindly if you are new here you know how we do it subscribe share and don't forget to leave a comment. Your comments are really helping, are really helping. So kindly do that one thing. Until next time, bye-bye.